this is Aliyah. Today we're going to make sardine tagine. It's basically sardine kefta balls cooked in this spiced tomato sauce to die for. So let's start! Step 1. Prepare the ingredients. For the spices you will need paprika, cumin, pepper, salt, red chili pepper, tomato paste, crushed garlic and lemon juice. You will also need tomatoes, onion, preserved lemon, finely chopped fresh parsley, and cilantro, and green olives for extra yumminess. And of course, olive oil. For the sardine kefta, click the box to view the previous video in this series on how to make it. Step 2. Prepare the sardine kefta. In a large bowl, combine the sardine kefta with pepper, salt, ground paprika, ground cumin, chili pepper powder, crushed garlic, lemon juice, finely chopped parsley, and finely chopped cilantro. Mix all the ingredients together with your hands Moroccan style. Let the kefta marinate while we prepare the tagine sauce. Step 3. Prepare the tomato sauce. Cut the tomatoes in half and grate the pulp using the large holes of the grater. Discard the skin. In a large bowl, combine the grated tomato pulp, pepper, salt, ground paprika, ground cumin, red chili pepper powder, crushed garlic, tomato paste, finely chopped parsley, finely chopped cilantro, and olive oil. Mix all the ingredients. Step 4. Prepare the tagine. Slice the onion into thin slices. Place the onion slices in the tagine plate over medium heat. Cover the onion slices with half of the tomato sauce. Roll the sardine kefta into balls the size of a walnut and place them on top of the tomato sauce. Gently, using a spoon, pour the rest of the tomato sauce over the sardine balls. Cover the tagine and cook on medium-low heat for around 30 to 40 minutes or until the sardine balls are done. Step 5. Final touches. Cut the preserved lemon into thin slices. Once the tagine is cooked and the sardine balls are done, top them with the preserved lemon slices and add the green olives to the sauce. Cover the tagine and continue cooking for another 3 minutes for the citrus flavors to combine with the sauce. Serve the tagine immediately hot with crusty bread. Mmm! Bon appétit!